Hey Peoria, it's Zach and Lee from Caterpillar Heritage Services. Behind me is the beautiful background of the city of Peoria and you can see Caterpillar's corporate headquarters. In front of me is the Caterpillar Trail or Highway 116. I can't tell you how many times I've driven down that road and wondered, hey, what is the story? Why is it called the Caterpillar Trail? Well, what we're gonna learn today is there's over a hundred years of history. So get in your car, sit back, relax, and we're gonna take a drive. The Caterpillar Trail was constructed over a hundred years ago in collaboration between the Holt Manufacturing Company and the city of East Peoria. Construction started really outside of the plant and ran for five miles to the Upper Free Bridge, which is just north of where the McCluggage Bridge is today. Murray Baker of the Holt Manufacturing Company was the person that came up with the idea of building the Caterpillar Trail. He was the visionary that brought Holt from Stockton, California to Peoria. Bringing Holt to Peoria made Murray Baker so famous, we even named a bridge after him. Baker saw the need for a road in East Peoria. He knew they didn't have funding, but he also saw there was an opportunity for Holt to test Caterpillar tractors in the world of road building. He knew the city needed a road and he had the right products to build it. The Caterpillar Trail was built by three Caterpillar tractors, two being Holt 75s and the other a Holt 60. The Holt 75 was their most successful tractor. It was the height of Holt innovation. By 1918, the project was completed. After construction, the trail became wildly popular with motorists with the advent of the automobile. The results of the effort are still visible today Today, the trail is also known as Highway 116. Although the size of it has changed, the path has not. Originally, it was only two lanes and it was gravel. Today, it's paved and it's four lanes. Thanks for watching and see you again for more Caterpillar History Moments.